What's up, Tyler? We got our broad brief Thursday, October 13th. Oh, almost Friday the 13th. Anyways, warm up with a partner, 12 movements, one rower, one rower, one partner's going to be working on the rower, other partner's going to be doing something else. Someone like the workout, right? So the, the warm up is quite robust, so quite a little while moving back and forth through rowing and other movements. Specific warm up. We're going to review the dumbbell lunge. We're going to find an appropriate weight for us to use for the workout. And we're going to review in detail GHD sit-ups, have an opportunity for all the athletes who want to try and practice and get on the GHD during this part of the work or part of the board or day session to get on it, do a little practice, get some pointers, um, get some repetitions in before we start our workout. All right. So that being said, we only have three GHD machines. Um, so we'll have to divide them up. Maybe we can take teams of two, teams of two, teams of two, and sort of rotate around so everyone gets a little bit of time on the GHD if they want it. Uh, that would be the fairest way to do it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. We have our workout, hold my beer. And what it is, AMRAP 20 minutes, RX version. Partner number one is going to be working on the rower and they're going to row for max calories. Partner number two is going to be working on 10 dumbbell lunges, 25 and 35 pounds. And that's two dumbbells, one in each hand, followed by 15 GHD sit-ups. All right. Once the person, partner two, who's working on the lunges and the GHD sit-ups are finished, you switch. And then once the other partner number one finishes, you switch back. So it's gonna go off whenever you're done, your last GHD, then we switch. If there's no GHD machine available, we can do a number of things, okay? We can do V-ups, we can do single leg V-ups, and we can do sit-ups. Those are some of the options we have, not limited to though, all right? Level number two is same workout, 20 minutes long, Max calories on the rower, 25 and 35 pounds for the dumbbell lunges, and GHD to parallel. So not going all the way back and getting that super athletic movement. And then level one is going to be 10 and 15 pounds for the dumbbell lunges, followed by sit-ups, right? Same rep scheme, same time frame. All right, a couple things, goals we're looking at for athletes in a team, five to six rounds each, and approximately 150 to 300 calories. So there's a huge 150 gap there, right? And that's cause today might be an opportunity to wind down the intensity, ratchet down the intensity as we've been going pretty hard. Yesterday's workout was super high intense, clean and jerks, bar muscle ups or um, scaling option. Uh, intensity through the roof, try to get it done in 10 minutes or less, right? So. This is, might be an opportunity to take that row a little bit slower than you regularly would in the workout and just use it as a little recovery. And then during the lunges and the sit-ups, we might be just working out as normal, right? So that can be a strategy for today's workout or we're gonna go hard on both, right? Depends, are you coming off a day off? Is this your sixth day in a row? That all comes into play here and your body sort of will dictate to you what's gonna happen. Now, if you know you've been on it and you've been going hard, you've been stepping on the gas pedal and you want to wind it back a little bit on the rower, that's all good. However, we're not going to be just like rowing sort of like this. We're still, still going to put a, a strong effort into proper technique, posture, all the good stuff, and maybe we just ratchet down the intensity a little bit, okay? Um, that's what I have to say about this workout. It's going to be a good one. Uh, good chance to work out with, with someone you don't know. That might be an option too, like someone new to the gym or you haven't partnered up before. The other thing is, if you're going to go hard at it, right? Maybe find a person that's going to have that same sort of thing. All right, I want to go hard on this workout. I just had my day off yesterday. I'm ready to go. Uh, maybe that you two can talk and hey, okay, we're going to get after this workout, right? And if you're going to get after it, get after it. Um, that's our hold my beer for Thursday, October 13th. Let's have some fun with it. I'll see you guys in the morning. Enjoy.